pose. No, go back. I have to sneeze. I don't want to sneeze though. <laughs> I say this every time my videos start, but no, for a welcome back to my channel. I thank you for the support and love that you guys show. I love my community. I love my friends. These are awesome. <laughs> so for this video, I have an IFBB Pro posing coach. Her name is York. I will put links to her Instagram's posing page and links to her website in the description. So she was just giving me the commands and the directions, and that's what I was doing. I did also hit a workout at that gym as well. It's Powerhouse New Haven. It is an awesome gym. Her husband is a co-owner, and I absolutely love it there. My show is going to be somewhat hosted by that gym, if that makes sense. And we're super close. So before we know it, I'm going to be on stage, yo, for the first time. Now, I have experience performing and being on stage so that doesn't bother me but I haven't been on stage in a bikini showcasing my physique being judged like I haven't done that before showcasing like all of my hard work over the past couple years and showing like what I've built underneath all that fluff that I cut off I didn't have a whole lot of fluff but honestly you know what's crazy looking back and I'm gonna put it Post the, put, what? Put a picture right here. 16 weeks. And I'm going to put a picture right here where I am now. I did not realize how lean I actually got. And I know a lot of my friends said that I was still lean at this time. But if you look at me now, no. I see veins popping everywhere more and more every single day. It's insane. My mood isn't necessarily up and down but my energy levels and my body is up and down daily my mood i've been good my mental state has been good thank god praise god because sometimes i'd be going through it and have as many mental breakdowns as i thought that i would i knew i was capable of doing this but i did underestimate it i'm not gonna lie however i'm gonna see it through to the end god willing and yeah, so I will see you at the gym with my posing coach. Love you guys. One, two, side pose. One, two, transition, straight arm. Good, open back pose. One, two, close. Time to step forward. Move your arms as you turn around and hold. And then back into the side pose. One, two, close. Okay. All right, let's do it again. Okay, first pose, we're going to get to the box. One, two, side pose. Okay, come forward, transition. Good, open back pose. Perfect, close. Side knee step forward, move your arms as you turn around, and hold. And then, hold right into your side pose, beautiful. And then close and say your goodbye. Success.
did a voiceover for this, but I am definitely going to do an introduction for this video so that uh, you yeah, can understand more. I did work out here, so I will be taking you with me on the workout. I might do a voiceover, I might not. It was kind of a serious workout. I like adding, you know, sprinkles of goofy stuff or whatever in there as well, but let's see. So I started documenting at 12 weeks out on Instagram and then bi-weekly I posted updates and then eventually it's going to become weekly and then daily. So for peak week I'm going to be posting just every single day how it's going. That's it. Okay, physique update, this is how I look today, how I'm feeling, etc. Six days out, five days out, four days out, three days out, show day. Now, I'm not going to be putting show day in any of it except for the documentary. Stay tuned for the documentary. I'll probably do the chiropractor video first. Now, in that one, I did have a mental breakdown. I don't know if I'm going to include that in the video. And I'm just talking. So usually when I film my videos, I just talk, story tell, etc. I want to share something with you guys. That kind of scared me a little bit. I almost passed out at the gym, which was pretty scary. I got up from the machine way too fast knowing I was dizzy, I was seeing stars, but yet I still walked over to wipe down the sweat off of my machine. So I walked over to the paper towels and the spray bottle, and the next thing I know, I didn't even actually get to grab it. I just was leaning forward and I was like, oh, going down, and I hit my head on one of the machine handles that was near the paper towels in the spray bottle, and I was like, oh, okay, we're awake now. I don't want that to happen again. That was really, really scary. But towards the end of the workout, I did feel like I was going to pass out. We are getting down to the nitty gritty. We're not going to do this. We're not going to do the brain not braining thing anymore, okay? No mas. <laughs> 